Here's the idea. I run a workshop with my students where we simulate a requirements gathering process for a new budget tracker iOS application. It's messy with lots of back and forth conversations, but I'll upload the raw transcripts from those meetings. Okay, I'm creating a new uh, notebook for this project and I'm going to upload all these meeting transcripts. In total, it's about 10 hours of meetings and we'll give it some time to process it. And now let's do some magic and I'll use this prompt. Write a project charter following the best practices of project management. In the sections where you don't have enough information, give me questions to ask the customer about this project and put it in the brackets. Explicitly state in and out of scope of this release. Now let's give it some time to process it and look on the outputs. All right, it took about 30 seconds, but just look at this. Uh, it has perfectly pulled out requirements from the transcript and written a full project charter. Think about it, how much time would it take to take all the notes from the meetings, review the transcripts if you have them, and write this one manually? And let me point out on this uh, thing that I asked it to put into the brackets. These are the questions to ask the customer. And look at these ideas. What are the key milestones for this six month MVP project? Are there any specific review and approval cadence for deliverables? What is the formal process of handling scope changes and new feature requests? Uh, I would definitely include these ideas into the next training. Now you can imagine you have an ongoing thread of conversations around this topic and you can add more transcripts, more documents and even your own notes and you will continuously work with this documentation as a whole. Think about all possible ways to analyze the same information. For example, identify 10 most critical risks for this release. Or maybe uh, later down the road you forgot something. For example, you must find out is the iPad version of the app is in the scope of the MVP release. Or what I like even better is this use case. Identify the 10 most important questions for the customer to ask at the next meeting. Give me just a bulleted list of questions. Now you can analyze the questions and think about whether you want to ask them directly to the customer or come up with a solution. For example, what banks to include in the first release, uh, what are the limitations of AI and so on.